So I have good news and bad news. The good news is that Australia just flew the last refugee from the Nauru Detention Centre to Brisbane, marking the end of one of the darkest chapters in modern Australian history. The bad news is that the Australian government will still be paying MTC, a US prison contractor who have previously been accused of gross negligence and egregious security failures, 350 million taxpayer dollars per year to run a totally empty detention centre just in case. Yeah. Yikes. So for those who don't know, Australia does this thing called offshore processing, where whenever a refugee arrives via unauthorised boat, we send them to an Australian run compound overseas, basically just keeping them in prison limbo in an attempt to make them give up and go back to the country they fled for their own safety and exposing them to various levels of human rights violations along the way. At its height, the Nauru Centre held 1,200 people, but its numbers have been dwindling for years as refugee boats have become exceedingly rare. But the government still staunchly maintains their border policies have not changed and that the Nauru compound will remain garrisoned and ready to receive any unauthorised maritime arrivals.